Hello, Sagittarius. Thank you for tuning into my channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support, and I send it right back to you guys. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment. This reading resonates. With that being said, let's go ahead and see what messages are coming through for you guys at this time. Spirit of love and light, truth and clarity. What messages do you have for a sign of Sagittarius? Messages for a sign of Sagittarius. Strength. So you guys have been remaining strong during a difficult situation here. Um, Scorpio just have this insane placement. I'm getting this message of you getting your flowers from someone. I, I am definitely getting... Some of y'all could have been dealing with a Scorpio or you have strong Scorpio placements because it's almost like you're on the other end of the Scorpio reading. And I'm really getting like with the strength card, like you have remained strong and patient with someone else. Um, it's like someone who... It's like they have a lot of wild ways and I'm getting that you let this situation go, but like the message that I'm getting is like you let something go and it's, it now it's coming back to you. So now you know. Um, but this is someone you don't feel like you got the attention that you deserve from this person in the past, but now they're giving you all the attention here. It's like they're coming in um, and sweeping you off your feet. You know, the funny thing is someone could be born the year of the horse, but it's almost like someone is looking at you because I'm getting that you're getting a lot of attention from several people. There are several people interested in you, but there is someone who is not speaking up and this person they definitely have a lot of love for you, but they're coming across like they're really shy and timid. They're not speaking up. Um, they may want to hold on to their freedom, but there's someone else that's giving you like all the attention and you love the attention that you're getting from this person. And like the message that I'm getting is because like this other person didn't speak up. They literally like carry this person in on their back just by not speaking up speaking their truth and it's really going to hurt them to like let this go but at the same point they're not doing anything to like keep you in their life the hank man the higher offense overall energy is the judgment and i believe scorpio and these are two separate decks, too, because I believe Scorpio had the judgment right here, too. Um, your advice, or I'm really getting that this is what you're doing, because, no, it's not your advice. It's showing up as your overall energy, and this is you honoring your feelings. You're honoring the way you feel, the way things make you feel, being around certain people make you feel. You're honoring your, your uh, feelings here. With the judgment here, I am getting the possibility of a reconciliation, um, now, with the Hierophant being your advice here, you're needing to take a traditional approach towards something. Give me more about the Hierophant. The Hermit. They're wanting you to take a more practical approach towards something, to think something, uh, to think something through, to like take the time to look over something before rushing into it. More about the judgment. Two of Pentacles. So you'll have the opportunity to reconcile with someone, but that's not going to be the only option that you have. And it's going to be up to you as to which relationship you're wanting to prioritize here. Your outcome is the hangman. Why is this the outcome? The lovers and the three of, uh, the two of swords. You have two people pouring out their heart to you. You do. 
you have two people pouring out their heart to you. It looks like one person is seeking information. So they may have someone spying on you or getting information from someone else about you. And someone, someone else is having a pity party over you. So they're all in their emotions about you. They're basically saying like they feel like they've lost out on this connection. And look, I'm telling y'all, here it goes. This is this uh, King of Swords. They're, they're setting out this, what is it, Falcon to get information on you. There could be distance between you and this person. But there's someone giving this uh, King of Swords information. They're not uh, opening up communication just yet. But if you see, they have this crown right here. They're waiting for the right person to crown, to be by their side. And they feel like you're the one, but they're trying to make sure before they present you with this offer. I don't even get, I'm not getting that they're even, um, they're not sure if you're even in a relationship or not. But they're definitely getting information on you one way or the other. They could even be getting readings. Now, with this King of Cups energy that's coming through, it looks like this is someone that you planned out a future with some time ago. Yet, action has not, no one has taken action on this connection quite yet. There's no action. But there is some sort of agreement between you and this person. I'm really getting that because they haven't taken action towards you. This could be the person you end up leaving behind. Because it's your choice as to who you're going to give your time and attention to. And you have the lovers clarifying the hangman. So it's like after waiting some... Because I'm getting that like you sacrificed a lot in order to have the right person. In order to be with the right person. And that's what you're about to receive. Like this person is being divinely guided towards you. Someone has definitely been single for some time. Give me one more. You could have quite possibly met this person at work. Some of y'all could be dealing with the Taurus. Gemini, but it doesn't have to be Leo as well. Taurus, Virgo's coming through too. I'm getting another Scorpio energy. But there is someone that you're about to take the time to get to know. Uh, whoever this person is, they're very accomplished. They have a lot going on for themselves. They're just looking for someone to share their life with. How will they know who this person is? How will they know who this person is? Ooh, honey, y'all got some, y'all have two people fighting over you. You have two people fighting over you. It's going to be two people. It's not going to be one. The decision is going to be yours. Um, It looks like you're about to be just living it up. You're, you're going to really be enjoying life, celebrating life with friends, family, having a great jolly time. And you have these two people fighting for your attention. And the decision is going to be yours. The options, you have the options here. Honey. <laughs> Let's see. I'm going to tell y'all as many times as I've seen the hangman card, I still always want to flip it over because it always looks like it's upside down. Let's see. Messages for um, Sagittarius who are in a relationship. I almost called y'all Scorpio. Some of y'all have strong Scorpio placements or y'all deal with some Scorpios. Like you receive the wish fulfillment for my Sagittarius that are in a relationship. Like you feel you feel like you received everything that you could have ever asked for in this connection. 
Ooh, so their energy. Um, let me see, because I, I do get that they feel like they get a lot of attention from you and they like that. They like the attention that they get from you. But I'm really getting the way they perceive you. It's like you can come across a little cold from time to time. But it's just the fact that you have healthy boundaries. And that's something that they're learning to respect. Outcome is the chariot. I like it. I, I see this relationship going places and in a good way. So... There's a lot of things that you guys have yet to explore. I'm definitely getting like you guys end up uh, going on some trips here shortly. But I definitely see this uh, relationship going places. You both are very determined to make this work. And I, I see it happening for the two of you. So messages regarding the person that Sagittarius is in separation from. Messages regarding the person that Sagittarius is in separation from. Okay, we got the Three of Pentacles. So you do want to work on this with this person. They have transformation, so they're in the process of going through some things here. Your outcome is the Ace of Cups, but let's see if it's going to be from this person. Why is a tr uh, transformation showing up in their energy? Six of uh, Wands. I don't get that they were giving you attention in the past, but they're about to be giving you attention now. It's like their energy has shifted. Give me one more about this. Or they feel like you're getting a lot of attention. Yeah, I'm getting that. They're looking at you like you're getting a lot of attention. Because with transformation, I'm getting false foundation. I keep hearing false foundations. So meaning what they, the way they used to perceive you, the way they used to view you in the past, like that has significantly changed. And they're realizing, because I'm getting that you're extremely successful or you're about to be, you're getting a lot of attention from several people. So the way they viewed you has changed because you have changed. I'm getting a lot of success. Your finances look like they're going, uh, they're doing very well. And however they're witnessing this, they're seeing all this. You're fine on your own. You're not desperate to be in relationships. So your energy has shifted. And that's something that they are beginning to realize about you. You do have love coming in. But I'm not sure if this offer is from this person or someone new. Because there's a new beginning taking place here in love for you. To clarify, we have the Eight of uh, Cups and the Page of Pentacles. Now, I am getting there's a new beginning in love between you and this person that you're in separation from. Because this is someone that you've walked away from. They're going to end up messaging you. This is someone who's missing you. Someone who feels at a loss without you being in their life. This is someone that, this is this person that you're in separation from. So you already know this person that you're going to have a new beginning in love with. Messages for my single Sagittarius. Messages for a single Sagittarius. Six of Swords. Renewal. Okay. Continue to do what you're doing. Continue to work on things in your life. I'm getting like someone's working hard towards their career. Someone could be back in college as well. But you're being very diligent. You're working very hard. You're very focused on uh, your life at this time. Your finances, your career. And that's what's attracting the suitor towards you very fast because there's someone that's really excited about taking action towards you and they will be taking action towards you. This is someone who is very successful as well. They're coming through with the King of Pentacles energy. So this is someone who's looking for a long-term committed relationship. <coughs> oh, I'm sorry. So 
your energy is showing up as the six of swords. I'm getting that there's a lot of things that you're leaving in the past. You're ready for a new life. That's what I'm getting coming from someone. And that's what you're headed towards. Like things are uh, changing for the better in your life. There's a complete renewal in your life. And that's in your love life and career and finances as well. I'm definitely getting like things just improving for you. And that's because you've been putting in the work in order for these changes to take place. So messages regarding the person that Sagittarius is in separation from. So we have the King of Swords. Ten of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. I like it. We also have the Empress. Um, so this person thinks very highly of you. They definitely want to love and nurture this connection between the two of you. Uh, their energy is coming through as a Ten of Pentacles. They could come from a wealthy family, uh, but I'm definitely getting that they're financially well off. They have a great relationship with their family as well. Like family is very important to this person. Honor and traditions is very important to this person as well. They are coming towards you with a stable offer here. Something that you can rely on, you can trust. Um, your energy is coming through as the king of swords. <laughs> I like it. Um, you can come across as a little cold and distance at times, but... I'm really getting that you're just more thoughtful in regards to your approach when it comes to love. And I don't get that you've always been that way. It's just that's the way you've learned to to that's you've learned to become that way because of being disappointed in the past um, by previous relationships. So that has significantly shifted your energy here. But I am getting I am getting that you're excited about this connection with this person, but you're just not going to show them that until you feel like you can really trust this situation. And I am getting that you can trust this situation because it looks like this person respects you and they want to take very good care of you as well. Okay, messages regarding new love for Sagittarius. New love for Sagittarius. Okay, you definitely have new love right off the bat. We have Knight of Cups. So you have a romantic proposal headed your way from someone. Strength. Outcome, Seven of Swords and the Two of Wands. Why the Seven of Swords? like it um to be honest with you Sagittarius and the energy that I'm getting so I do I am definitely getting that there is someone that's going to be flirting with you they're going to be asking you out on dates but there's something about this situation where you feel the need to remain strong and to be patient with this person and the reason why I'm, I'm getting that you feel the need that you you feel the need to remain strong and to be patient with this person is because I'm getting that they're lying about another relationship. So really what I'm getting is this person is telling you that they plan on leaving someone, but they really don't. They don't plan on leaving this situation. It's like, and I don't know if it's like a situation where they feel like it's just cheaper to stay in a marriage or what, but... I'm not getting that they're being honest with you and whatever they're telling you that they're planning on doing, they're not being honest about it. And that's why I'm getting like ultimately your energy is coming to the hermit where you feel the need to step back to withdraw your energy from this situation. And it's like in the end, I get you like taking a step back from this relationship and going within and really questioning yourself, like, why do you continue to attract these type of energies? Why do you continue to, like, uh, settle for this when you know this person is being dishonest? But it's really uh, triggering you to take a look within yourself. Um, this relationship is. So if someone comes towards you and this is resonating and you know that they're involved with someone else, be mindful about that because I don't get that they ever plan on really leaving 
the person that they're with, they're just kind of stringing you along. Sagittarius, I don't know who this is for, but I'm getting a strong reconciliation energy between you and someone else. Someone is about to reach out, okay? I'm getting that you you know this. You know this. The two of you seem to balance each other out very well. You And I am getting that you trust this person, or at least you guys are starting from scratch. You're forgiven, um, and you're learning to trust one another. But... This person is about to reach out, and it seems like you've known that this person will be reaching out sometime. Uh, because I'm getting that you've been in the process of rebuilding yourself, rebuilding your life just in general. But I'm also getting rebuilding a connection between you and someone else. I do get the two of you complement each other very well. There's a lot of hands involved in this relationship. So you could have children, they could have children. I am getting quite possibly children are involved in this relationship. Uh, but there's other people who play a part in this connection between you and this person. But I'm definitely getting that you're both going to make um, a conscious effort to give to this relationship and to make it work. I definitely see things going better this time around. Um in comparison to how it went before. So they could be slightly older than you or they could just be uh, mature. You could look at them as being extremely mature. I'm telling y'all. You have a union coming in. I definitely am getting that you have your back turned towards this person. You've grown a little cold towards them. Um, but I definitely see like you guys rebuilding this connection here and stronger than ever. It's a lot of stability within this relationship between you and this person. They could be showing up at your home, but I'm not getting like they're disrespecting your boundaries. I am getting that they'll ask to come see you. They won't just pop up on you. Uh, but this is leading towards a long-term committed relationship between you and this person. I want to give one more. You, I, I'm getting that you could have met this person at work. Or you guys are just deciding to work on this relationship. But I am getting a strong reconciliation between you and someone else. Um, I am definitely getting that you're, you're not going to take it easy on this person, but they know that, but they're still coming towards you. This person does have a lot of love for you. So I'm going to leave it there. These are the messages that came through for you guys at this time. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel and leave a comment. This reading resonates. But with that being said, you all take care.